welcome problem solving fans to another problem of the day and this one's all about a plank of wood which is 4.6 meters long three lengths of wood are cut from the plank one and a quarter meters 165 centimeters and 390 millimeters how much wood is left now the first thing to notice here that we've got all sorts of things going on we've got mixed units so we've got meters centimeters and millimeters so we'll need to understand the connections between those and also we've got fractions and decimals as well so we've got one and a quarter and we've got 4.6 meters now the first thing we need to do is convert everything into the same unit so it's a good idea to keep things simple and turn everything into centimeters well, one meter is 100 centimeters. So four meters would be 400 centimeters. And then 0.5 would be a half. Well, half of 100 is 50. So 0.5 meters would be 50 centimeters. And that means 0.6 meters would be 60 centimeters. So 4.6 meters is actually 460 centimeters. The plank of wood is 460 centimetres before anything is being cut off. Now the next job is to turn the other three measurements into centimetres as well. The lengths of wood that are being cut from the plank. Well if a whole metre is 100 centimetres and half a metre is half of that, so 50 centimetres, a quarter of a metre would be half the 50 centimetres again, which would be 25 centimetres. So one and a quarter metres would be 100, which is the one whole metre, and then a quarter is an extra 25, so it's 125 centimetres. 165 centimetres already in centimetres, so we'll leave that one as it is. And 390 millimetres. Well, one centimetre is 10 millimetres, so if we figure out how many lots of 10 millimetres goes into 390, we'll have how many centimetres that is. Well, 390 divided by 10, is 39 so it's going to be 39 centimeters so the final piece of wood that's being cut off is 39 centimeters now an obvious thing to do next would be to add together these three bits of wood that are being chopped off to see the total amount that's being chopped off so 125 plus 165 plus 39 let's see what's being cut off altogether 5 and 5 is 10, plus 9 is 19, put the 9 in, carry the 1. 2 plus 6 is 8, 8 plus 3 is 11, and 11 plus 1 is 12. Put the 2 in, carry the 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 3. So 329 centimetres are being cut off. Now we need to figure out what we've got left. Well, the last step is to take what we started with, which was 460, and cut off the 329. So we need to do a subtract 460, take away 329. 460, take away 329, and whatever this leaves us with will be the amount of wood which is left. So zero take away nine, we can't do, so borrow. Borrow from the six, that becomes five, and the one we've borrowed makes the zero into 10. 10 take away nine is one, 5 take away 2 is 3, 4 take away 3 is 1. So the amount of wood that is left is 131 centimetres. If you want that back into metres, that would be 1.31 metres.